All right, hey guys, here we are back for more guides. This is the ultimate golf tournament on Thursday here that we're going to be talking about. Here you can see we got a little bit of a tailwind. I'm going to use a cruiser ball. I do like to get this hole down there. It's a reasonable chance at a hole out. So the farther you drive it, kind of the better. If I had like a headwind, I might, you know, try to go up to like a, you know, something with wind reduction. That's going to also still add a little bit of power, power, something like a spider or blue bar, depending on what, what the wind looks like. Here we're going to use a cruiser and... You know, the biggest reason that I like to do that here is to really get this. You can see we're in here a little bit closer. We're in with the sniper here for the approach. Now, landing on this green, it should release some. But I'm also landing on an upslope. So, I wouldn't imagine this to roll out too, too, too far. Now, I've still been trying to get familiar with uh, this sniper. And this is one of the first times that I've really had a large wind. So this is where I start making mental notes as to how much to go. I have a feeling that it's going to be more than two on my rings, but maybe not by much. So I'm thinking about pulling like right down here and kind of just over two rings here for this sniper, which is at a level three. So let's just see what that looks like. And you know, that's kind of how I figure out how much to go is just kind of trial and error. So we try something. I'm very close to the max line. It looks like I'm just a tad light. So if I would have went maybe one or two tenths more, there you can see it's just a little bit more than that. So maybe maybe this sniper it does play pretty close to maybe 2.2 per ring, give or take. So if the wind is 4.7 and at 2.2, um, you know, that's maybe like 2.2 .2 rings, give or take. And I probably went just a hair more than two, maybe 2.1, maybe. So, um, you know, I didn't have to go very much more. And as you can see, um, we also had good distance control. You can see landing on that green. We didn't even have to touch the spin. This ball was more for wind reduction. And also, you know, because of the fact that it was a tailwind, that's why I used what I did. But uh, good luck on that hole. I'll see you guys on two momentarily.